In this video, I'll be comparing a bunch of different web hosting platforms in order to show you what their price points are, as well as which one you should ultimately go for. We've used all the platforms that we're talking about today, so we know all about the pros and cons, what to expect for the price, and what's worth it in the end for you. We're going through a bunch of different price points for different people. So yeah, with all that being said, let's get into the video. Okay, so the first platform that we're going to be talking about today is Wix. And if you guys click on the link down below, you guys can get taken to this page right here where you can get started with Wix for free. All you have to do is just enter in your email address and then click start now. But although it's free, I do recommend upgrading because then you get access to the custom domain. And this is 100% worth it if you're a business owner that wants to look more professional. But yeah, I would say that Wix is the best overall website builder. As you guys can see, they have really good templates. It's also very easy to use with their drag and drop features. And yeah, you can use Wix for anything, whether it be an online store, a blog, or an online portfolio. Now, when it comes to their pricing, you can see right here that they have a light package for just $16 per month. But with this, you only get about two gigabytes worth of storage. And you don't have access to a bunch of other features like e-commerce, site analytics, as well as the ability to accept payments. Although it is pretty pricey as you go up the plans, I would say that Wix is the best overall website builder because of how easy it is to use for beginners, as well as the fact that you can use Wix for pretty much any type of website. Okay, now let's move on to the next platform and that is Hostinger. Now, if you guys click on the link down below, you guys are gonna get taken to this page right here, where as you guys can see, you can start off at $2.99 per month plus three months for free. So you can see immediately there's a huge price difference between Hostinger and Wix and they also have a 30-day money-back guarantee. So yeah, really good for beginners that are just getting started. And if I go ahead and scroll down to their pricing plans, you can see that they have a ton of features even for their basic plan. So they have the ability to create 100 different websites, 100 gigabytes of storage, unlimited free SSL, a free email, and a free domain name, and a bunch of other features that you guys can check out on their website. Now, they also have a business plan as well as a cloud startup, and this allows for more storage and better performance. But yeah, I always recommend just starting off with the premium plan. That one usually is just fine for most beginners. And yeah, I would say that if you're looking for the most bang for your buck, then Hostinger is the best platform. You also have different options of how to build your website. So you can go with WordPress or with Hostinger's website builder. So with WordPress, you pretty much have unlimited customization. And then with Hostinger's website builder, that one is less customizable, but it's very easy to use. So it's similar to a platform like Wix. So yeah, there aren't any free plans compared to Wix. And if you guys want to go with Hostinger, we also have a special code that you guys can enter. So I'll go ahead and show you guys right now. If I click add to cart, that's going to bring me to this page where I can choose a time period. And then if I scroll all the way down, it'll say have a coupon code. I'll go ahead and click on that. And then right here, I'll type in Charlie Chang. Once I apply that, it's going to increase the discount. So yeah, I'm getting one year worth of web hosting. And this is 100 website with the free domain name and everything for just $32. Again, we'll leave a link down below for you guys to check out hosting. Okay, moving on to the next platform, we have Squarespace. And if you guys click on the link down below, you guys can get taken to this page right here where you can start your free trial. There's no credit card required. All you have to do is click on get started. And then it's going to ask you a few questions about what your site is about. As you guys can see, they have a bunch of different templates that look really professional. And you have the option of choosing a professionally designed website template or building a custom template with the Squarespace blueprint. And yeah, going through all the different templates that they have, they have stuff for online stores, portfolios, memberships, blogs, courses, services, and then they even have specific topics. So for example, photography, food, weddings, real estate and properties. So yeah, let's say that we're trying to start a blog. I can go ahead and scroll down and then look at all the different blog templates. So yeah, I would say that Squarespace is mostly for blogs and personal portfolios. So yeah, if you're a freelancer, a photographer, a designer, and things like that, then yeah, Squarespace can definitely be a great option for you. And yeah, it's also very easy to use. So this dashboard right here, and if I want to edit anything, I'll just click on this button right here. And as you guys can see, it's literally just clicking into the text and then changing it. And if I want to move stuff around, it's literally just click and drag. Very, very simple. The templates look amazing. I can replace this text and the images with my stuff. So yeah, as you guys can see, very easy to use just like Wix. Now, the only thing that I'll say is that it's not the best platform if you're an e-commerce entrepreneur. And that's because there's other great platforms like Shopify, which we'll talk about later. And yeah, with their pricing plans, it's very similar to Wix. Maybe it's a little bit cheaper once you upgrade the plans, but starting off with the personal plan, it's pretty much the same at $16 per month. Again, very simple, very easy to use. And with Squarespace, you can literally create a website for your business in under an hour. Okay, next up is Kajabi. And while this is the most expensive platform on the list, it does give the most value compared to all the other platforms. And yeah, if you use all the features and tools within in the platform, you can easily make that money back and more. So if you guys click on the link down below, you guys can get taken to this page right here where you can start a 30 day free trial. And as you guys can see right here, you can do a bunch of different things like build courses, coaching programs, memberships. And this doesn't even include everything because we also use it for creating marketing funnels. You can use it for a newsletter. We sell our digital products from Kajabi. It's really an all in one platform. So you can avoid the hassle of using third party platforms for all the different things within your business. And yeah, taking a look at their pricing, you guys can see that with the annual plan, you're going to 
you get billed $119 per month for the basic plan. And with this, you can sell anything on the platform and they won't charge you any transaction fees. You get three products, three funnels, unlimited landing pages and marketing emails, 10,000 contacts, and one website. Now for us, we use the pro plan because we actually have three different websites on Kajabi. And as you guys can see, it is the most expensive on this list at $319 per month. But again, this platform pretty much pays for itself if you're actually using the tools. I would say that this is great for serious entrepreneurs with personal brands. And although it's not as customizable as other platforms like Hostinger, it is very, very easy to use. And so it's great for busy entrepreneurs that don't need a super customized website. Rather, they just need a website to host all of their business. So yeah, if you're a total beginner, then I would say that Kajabi is probably not for you. But if you decide to grow your personal brand over the years, and let's say you start a course or you have a coaching program, then yeah, Kajabi would definitely make sense. Again, we'll leave a link down below for you guys to try out their free 30 day trial. That way you guys can mess around with some of these platforms before you actually pay for it. And yeah, if you guys do end up purchasing, we do get a commission and that's just to help support the channel so that we can keep creating free content for you guys. Okay, next up I have SiteGround. And basically the only thing that I need to say about this is that it's great if you want a really fast website. So yeah, if you guys click on the link down below, you guys can get taken to this page right here. And as you guys can see, you can get started for just $2.99 per month. So this is the same price as Hostinger. And you also get a free email, SSL, CDN, and backups for your website. And yeah, taking a look at their plans, they have the startup plan, which is the one that we just saw. They also have a grow big plan for $5 per month. And then their biggest plan, which is $8 per month. And taking a look at the main differences between the features, we can see that the first plan only has 10,000 visits, 10 gigabytes worth of space, as well as only one website. All these plans have WordPress hosting, so it's super customizable, just like Hostinger. But when it comes to the visits, the space, as well as how many websites you can create, Hostinger definitely wins on these features. Now, one thing that I will say is that SiteGround is super, super fast. And this is actually the platform that we use to host our website startup wise. So yeah, if you're a business that needs their website to load super fast, then SiteGround is perfect for being able to do that at a really affordable price. Website speed is super important because how fast your website loads compared to other websites determines how high you rank on Google. So this could mean the difference between someone clicking on your website versus clicking on someone else's. And yeah, for most businesses, you wanna be on the top search result and you also want your website to load super, super fast. Okay, now the last platform that we're gonna talk about today is Shopify. And this without a doubt is the best platform if you're an e-commerce business. Right now they have an amazing deal. If you guys click on the link down below, you guys can get taken to this page where you can start a three month free trial for just $1 per month. Now this platform is used for most e-commerce stores because of how many integrations they have. And it's also very easy to use and set up if you're selling physical products. And taking a look at their pricing plans, they have a basic, a Shopify plan, and an advanced plan. For most businesses just getting started, the basic plan is just fine. And with this, you have up to a thousand different inventory locations. You have up to 77% shipping discount, and you also get basic reports. But once you guys obviously grow your team, then it would obviously make sense to upgrade your plan as well. But yeah, very easy to use. We have videos on this channel that will teach you how to start an e-commerce store using Shopify, and you can literally set up your store within an hour. So overall, here are my final thoughts on the cheapest web hosting platform. There's Wix, which does have a free plan, but you're not getting a custom domain, which means that if you want a legit website, then Hostinger is the cheapest web hosting platform for all the features that you get. Anyways, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys were able to get a lot of useful information. And we'll also leave links down below to our playlist where you can check out videos that will teach you how to use each of these platforms step by step. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more videos just like this. Here on this channel, we create a lot of how-to guides and tutorials dedicated to helping out new entrepreneurs start their own business. Thanks for stopping by and I'll see you next time.